hello everyone thank you so much for clicking this video and welcome back to my channel if you're new welcome so today i'm going to show you how you can make your own lace front wig and guys if you find this video helpful remember to give it a thumbs up comment and don't forget to subscribe the hair i'll be working with today is from euro they sent me this beautiful hair to make a wig for myself i'll put all the details in the description box down below just in case you're interested you can go check it for yourself so it came with these bundles three bundles of 24 inches and one lace front of 20 inches I already pinned down my cap on the mannequin so what you're going to do you're going to mark the middle part of the frontal so that it guides you on where to place the frontal and then you're going to place your frontal some few inches from the cap don't place it on top of the cap because when you do that later on when you cut the cap the cap might be smaller so just place it some few inches from the cap And remember guys I've stretched my frontal to the side and not to the back because that part is going to be under your ears so stretch it to the side and not to the back after you've placed the pin in the middle of the cup and on each side now we're going to sew it down use whichever sewing method you prefer as long as it's nice and tight We are done with the frontal and you can see it's nice, flat and neat. So I'm going to sew down the tracks and I'm going to double them because this hair is so long and full. I even wanted to use two bundles instead of three but then because I wanted the hair to be fuller, I decided to use the three of them. But this hair is so full. And then for the frontal, I used the thin thread but for the tracks, I'm going to use this thick one. But you can just use either. So I'm laying my tracks flat and just sewing through and I'm not going to cut the tracks because I don't want to experience any shading I'm going to use the fold method So one thing I love about their bundles is that they are really full most of the longer bundles they are thin But for this bundle they are 24 inches and they really have volume oh, you came and tucked your way into my heart. For my last bundle, I stopped doubling the tracks because I want to make sure it lies so flat. I'm cutting the lace and just be careful not to cut the stitches and the lace. So 
so guys you can see how full this hair is like this hair is really full so what i'm going to do since the lace is transparent i'm going to to apply concealer on it and then of course i'll have to stitch the band on it as well and pins just to make it more secure on my head and the cap fits so well so one thing you should just do when you're stitching your frontal make sure you don't put it on the cap so that the cap feels so well like this cap right now it feels so well So I already sewn three combs and the elastic band and the cap already had an adjustable strap so that that makes it secure and then since the lace is transparent i'm applying powder just to make it you know match with my complexion and then another thing i did i reduced the volume i actually blow dried it and flattened just to reduce the volume <laughs> So guys i really love how full this hair is and then you can flat iron this hair you can dye it you can as well straighten it and i didn't want the curls because i just wanted it to look this natural that's why i flat iron it then i comb the curls out so guys i'll put all the details for this week in the description box down below just in case you're interested i'll put all the links for euro so you can go follow them and that was it for today guys thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video and see you next time bye love you Mwah.